If you can't be on time, be early. Hi, 49. I'm Elise Costaglou, Senior Strategic Partner at Amazon, and I'm about to face 49 questions. Passionate, tenacious, and impatient. People who are late, if you can't be on time, be early. Jack of all trades, however, surround yourself with people who are experts in one. Uh, ideally 50-50, so I would love two days in the office, one with clients and then one in the actual office, and then three days in the office. Three days from home. <laughs> Definitely diversity, um, and this needs to start from who and how we are recruiting. The skill set that's required and the remuneration that is offered really only allows for a certain um, privileged individual, and that needs to change. Definitely branded content. I love branded content. It was for to celebrate Kobe Bryant's birthday um, by Nike, and the theme was all about uh, be better, and it it is very emotional. Uh, Guinness. I love the brand. I love everything that they stand for. I love everything that they do in our industry. And I love the product. Traditional. Winter. Delivery. Drama. Always drama. Underrepresented. I would say Whitney Wolf. Uh, she is the founder of, and CEO of Bumble and she is just one of the most incredible women in our industry and I would love to work for that company. So I have three. The first of which is all about do not disturb. If I have something that I need to do in the day, I will turn my phone on do not disturb. There's little annoying inbox pop-ups that pop up. I will make sure that they are silent. The second is to set my intention for the day. So I would map up uh, my day in the calendar as you would as if you had actual meetings. And then my third is listening to classical music. Uh, Zoom, I haven't used either enough to have a preference. Instagram, but I really, I really want to delete it. Neither, I, I don't use either. Entertainment, the news this year has been so disappointing. So escapism, I'll always take escapism. It would be that working long hours does not mean that you are a good worker. Nine times out of 10, it means that you're an inefficient worker. Um, so to really learn where to invest your energy in and then also learn um, how to say no, not straight up, but eventually learn how to say no. Home, Australia. Um, was winning the Future Leader Award for Wackel, which is Women in Advertising and Communications for London. I have never thought about this, but I, I'm, I go GIF. GIF like a, a G. The crying, laughing face, followed by a love heart. I am going to say Amazon. <laughs> they are so on the on the front foot of what customers want. They have products that we don't even know uh, that we want. Dressed up. I would always rather be uh, overdressed than underdressed. Coffee. Slack. Countryside. Definitely not being able to um, go back to Australia and see my family. Um, companies have been uh, forced to move away from the glorification of desk time, um, that being at your desk equals being productive, and so companies are now being forced to trust your employees. It's definitely the people and the interaction that we have with them every day. I don't think we're meant to work remotely forever. I hope we don't forever. The commute. I do not miss a London peak hour. We, um, in lockdown, bought a Peloton bike. <laughs> as soon as I finish a workout on that, I feel the most energized. I would say uh, my troop. Your troop are those um, people that you are around all the time. They're the, your network, they're the people that are closest to you. And I'm really proud of the people who, who are in my troop and I, I love them all um, so, so much. Oh, I'm an absolute sucker for um, going to American live sports. So the NBA, the NFL, the NHL, I love, love that. Uh, the Handmaid's Tale season three, just with everything going on in the world, it's, it's yeah, it's a very, very interesting season um, with some very interesting concepts that I think everyone should watch. I want to watch The Sopranos. I have absolutely no idea what it um, is about, but you know, you hear a lot about it. Apple News, so in the side of my iPhone, and I just follow a variety of publications so that I can get a bit of a rounded view of the world. 
publishers. Although I think we're we're definitely getting to um, an age where influencers are publishers, but yeah, for now, publishers. iPhone, PC. I think I'm a, in the minority that, that is a sucker for a PC. Eaten, definitely. My partner and I both both love to cook. A Barbie. Anything that you can put on a barbecue, I absolutely love. Wine, <laughs> and if not wine, probably water. That would definitely be my parents' um, farm back in Australia. Soho Farmhouse. If I could be anything or do anything, I would be a female version of Jamie Oliver. It would either be able to teleport anywhere or it would to be able to um, speak any language. Thanks for watching. Make sure to follow 49.